My name is Michelle Jordan, and I am the coordinator for this distribution center here at Village. So we started this distribution center back in May as a partnership with the city of Beaverton. The whole point of it was to help organizations stay afloat during the pandemic as more people are going to need help. And so we were focused on making sure that food was given to other organizations so they don't run out of food. Since then, we've gone from food to diapers to uh, hygiene supplies to blankets to all kinds of stuff. We've been able to work with Meals on Wheels, Home Plate Youth, ERCO, which is Immigration and Refugee Community Organization, WIC, Women's Infants and Children. We've been able to give diapers to migrant camps, Washington County Emergency Services, and even 10 fire departments. It's all over the place and it's been really great to work with this. As this distribution center progressed, I saw opportunities that God provided. The one thing that I kept doing was I said yes to everything that we did. Um, and that kept bringing more and more opportunities. We had one situation where we were supposed to provide uh, food for refugees for 75 families. And my initial reaction was there's, there's no way that that can happen. But I still said yes to it because I believe that I shouldn't limit God in that way. And even on the day of the distribution, we actually had someone donate 24 boxes of cereal. And their reaction was, we just thought that you needed cereal today. And it turned out to be the exact amount I needed to fill all of those boxes of food for those families. And so I see that God provides through this whole distribution center every day. We wouldn't be able to operate as well as we have without our congregation, without people participating, without feeling the need that exists today. This is all bread, cakes, bakery items, all from Safeway that they couldn't get rid of. So something about this distribution center is that we started it as a partnership with the city of Beaverton. And the whole point was to love our community. And as we started this series of love extravagantly, that's all that we're trying to do with this distribution center is to love our neighbors, love our community extravagantly.